Welcome to my pink wonderland. Words can't describe how excited I am to be doing this room tour with you guys this year. I'm going to start this off by showing you guys my vanity. And you guys have seen my vanity many times, but I just want to do an overview of how I spiced it up for Christmas. To the left of my vanity, I have these Alex drawers. And on top of them, I decorated it all white, kind of like a snow theme. And I put these cute little fuzzy slippers next to this adorable Merry Marshmallow Yankee candle. I also got the Le Grand Chateau, I don't know if that's how you pronounce it, but that eyeshadow palette from Too Faced Cosmetics, this adorable winter Eiffel Tower and this Christmas tree, and I also have this snowflake cookie candle which smells so good, and all of my fragrances are just set behind that. Now on to my Christmas tree. For those of you guys who are not aware of this, my whole entire bedroom is themed after the Nutcracker. This ballet completes my entire Christmas season and it gives me such a happy feeling, so why not make my room themed after it? So my ornaments I'm showing you right now are themed after the Nutcracker all along the side of my tree. And I know this sounds funny, but this side of my tree faces where I sleep, and I like staring at these ornaments as I'm falling asleep. So these are a lot of Clara ornaments. Clara's mom was below these ones. And a lot of ballerina ornaments. Um, this reminded me of Clara and the Nutcracker when they dance. That reminded me of a dancing snowflake from the ballet. This reminded me of a little dancing snowflake. And then there's Clara in her nightgown with the Nutcracker. And some of these ornaments are missing legs or hands because I've had them for a while. And this is the Sugar Plum Fairy and then Clara again. And you can't forget about the Nutcracker. And this ornament reminded me of a waltzing flower. And over here I have some shabby chic or glam ornaments. For this tree, I've been mainly sticking to a pastel theme, so I kind of just threw in some random cute little ornaments that just went with it. And I have this adorable hat box that I arranged to make it look like a gift under the tree. And here are just some more pretty little ornaments that I have up. Now I'm going to move over to my bed. I have these adorable huge dangling ornaments above my bed and then I have some opalescent tinsel and strung roses. And I got these two Santa pillows from Etsy and the sequin pillow is from PB Teen. And for those of you who didn't see it, that Santa belt pillow with the fur at the bottom was done on our Nikki and Gabby channel. To the left of my bed I have my slippers and they remind me of ballet slippers so they really go with the theme. Under my covers I have my adorable snow bunny bed sheets which brings me to Lily's room. She has a Christmas tree and she has the same snow bunny bed sheets like mommy. I also have her fur shawl sprawled out along her bed. <laughs> My room smells super Christmassy right now. I have the scent called Winter from Bath & Body Works plugged into my wall and I am stocked up with four extra in case it runs out. Over here I have Clara and her Nutcracker. The Nutcracker is from Hobby Lobby and Clara herself is from Avalon, New Jersey, some boardwalk Christmas shop. And next to them I have fresh sparkling snow and that glitter came with the candle. Isn't it just so adorable? Everyone thinks I added it in there but nope it came like that. And you guys have seen this before but this is my Eiffel Tower. It is actually a Christmas decoration so it just goes along with what I have. And over here I have party dress from Bath & Body Works along with other palettes from Too Faced and my Victoria's Secret Cosmetics bag as a decoration piece. I have all of my vintage clothing pieces on this rack, except that fur coat, it's not vintage. I just thought it looked cute on the rack. Here I have my mom's Miss America crown in a glass case. She was runner-up for Miss New Jersey when she was younger, and I have some of my purses 
in these little cubbies that go all the way down and yes I stuff my bags with newspapers so that they look full when they're in there and this is my cart and I still have my Chanel stuff at the bottom but at the top I decided to switch it up and make it more Christmassy. In this antique milk glass jar I have some white chocolate chips. This rose Christmas tree is from Etsy. This pastel reindeer is from an antique shop. This pink little snow house is from Etsy as well. And then this aqua sparkly triangular Christmas tree is from Hobby Lobby. This other Christmas piece is from Hobby Lobby as well. It looks like a frosted Christmas tree with pink little pom-poms on it. Right next to it I have my winter candle from Bath & Body Works. And to the left of it, I have another Bath & Body Works candle, and this smells just like a Christmas tree. I can't get over it. It just smells so Christmassy. Along with my room decor, I organize my accessories and clothing according to the season, and here are my winter pieces. And I'm actually redoing the inside of my closet soon, so I'm not going to be doing a closet tour just yet, but I will be doing that after Christmas. And right now I'm showing you just pretty much the Christmas or winter accessories I am keeping in my closet for the season. And over here are my vintage pieces that are pastel and go with the winter season that I have laid out to decorate my closet a little bit. And yeah, that's pretty much it guys. Stay tuned for Gabmas. I will let you know in my next vlog what that is. Let me know who I'm seeing December 30th in Freehold, New Jersey at iPlay. Yeah, that's pretty much it. I'll see you guys in my next vlog. Mm.